Okay, I finally have the 2x12 MTD collectors ready for the show at Farmingdale on uh, the 21st of April. Um, this is uh, how it's supported. The 2x12 collectors are supported with just two, uh, two inch, <laughs> got a lot of twos here, two inch PVC poles. So that should hold it in place. As long as the kids don't knock the poles out, I suppose we'll be okay. Now you can see the water is being pumped from this 20 gallon tank through a heater hose up to the top of the collector, right up here. And uh, from here, water is distributed to three collectors. Now we could also have 33 collectors, but I don't think I could fit them in my van, and I don't have the time to build them right now anyway. Anyway, uh, so this is where the, the water is distributed to the collectors at the top, and it's being pumped. Now, the, the pump is not powered by the battery. The battery is just a buffer between the sun and the pump. Uh, it sort of moderates the the power swing, uh, the power that's generated by the photovoltaic panel. Now right now you can see the voltage uh, from the battery is 12.2 volts. Uh, now the open, uh, the, the non-load voltage from the photovoltaic panel is actually 19 volts. Um, now as soon as you connect that to uh, the, the pump, the voltage, of course, is going to drop, but sometimes it's very erratic when the, the sun dump, jumps, uh, goes in and out of uh, the clouds, uh, the, the voltage jumps up and down, and that's not the best thing in the world for the pump. So the, um, the battery moderates uh, the voltage swing for the pump. You can see the, the temperature inside the collector right now is 135.8 degrees and the temperature inside the uh, heat storage chamber, this is the heat storage chamber, is 116.4 degrees. 